ain't catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on Bought a two-seater, yeah, we heading for the sun Shawty got my high, I ain't tripping for the fun What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Justin and Mahogany You to channel guys listen do me a big favor right now hit the subscribe button turn on those post notifications when you do make sure you comment what down below so we can make sure we shout you out y'all listen as y'all know my heart went to the hospital not too long ago it was like it was on thanksgiving day um so this morning we are here and she's at um, something else didn't happen, y'all. Something else didn't happen, but she's going to fill us in this morning. She's right here. Uh, we got up early, 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 early this morning. Um, but I'm here because y'all listen. I ain't let my baby go up to the, ho the doctor. That's how I'm there because I, what? I shut it down. Y'all already know. But how you feeling this morning? I'm feeling okay, guys. Okay. Um, not my best, but I'm feeling okay, you know. Ugh, so what's, it, what's, what's today's appointment? What's going on with you? So y'all, he makes it seem like I have so many different yeah. um, appointments. Yeah, too many health concerns. I'm get ready to cast that demon out. What was that? So I am um, here because I'm getting my psoriasis looked at. So as you guys know, even before my journey, I have scalp psoriasis. That's why like my hairline is the way it is, and why um, I have like the kind of like buildup that comes every now and then when I get stressed. And so then I also notice a few other places that I may have psoriasis, like in, under my boob area and my nails. And so for that, it's not like flaky, it's just like, it's different. If you look it up online, you can look up like scalp psoriasis, nail psoriasis, inverse psoriasis, but they're all psoriasis. So, ugh. Um, I'm here getting that looked at, <laughs> looked into. Um, so I'm trying to just wrap up just all of my lingering health concerns. I know it seems like I've been at the doctor so much, but y'all, I work so much. And, and, she, so and she has been at the doctor too much. It's like I work so much, y'all. I don't have much time to like do things for myself. I'm always taking care of the kids and everything. And so now I'm like this week I've been like, okay, well, I mean, you were concerned about this. Let's check this out. You were concerned about this. So I'm just kind of boom, boom, bam. So, yeah. Yeah, y'all. So y'all know I had to get up out of the bed this but morning. But I'm happy you healthy. You don't never go to the doctor. Cause good. listen, ain't nothing gonna get me down. That's but good. when I go down, I'm gonna get back up every time. Every time. Listen, all I know if I'm down, it must be hurt. Yeah. You gotta it, it, listen. It, God Himself gotta knock me off my feet, y'all. But no, I can't stand when Justin gets sick. It's so rare. It's like once a year. Mm -hmm. I feel like once a year you gotta. I can't stand work. to get. Yeah, I can't stand to get sick because my heart and whoo, Jesus, y'all. Y'all talking about hell. Justin, I'm he gonna go terrible when he gets sick. Because I'd be sick. If I'm in okay, pain, Justin, I'm in pain. I've, I've had multiple times where I've been in pain, where I've been nah, sick. But it's people, like I told you, it's people's pain tolerance. You can't judge yeah, you people. You don't have a high I don't have a high. I was so shut thing, down. But the thing is, I can be dealing with the same kind of pain as you, and I still, I don't get you running and stuff like that. No. You need somebody to tissue box right beside you. You need, hey, my honey, I can't honey, even move. I'm, like, I'm in so much pain. It's just like, I can't do it. I that. can't even move because I'm in so much pain. I need right, help. I, I'm trying to stay he comfortable. Help, he need help just to adjust the And ain't nothing wrong with that for your low pain tolerance. People make some noise in the comment. Listen, I got low pain tolerance, and that's fine with me. I can't do it. He need a pillow. He hit his head already on the pillow. My heart is Lift it up. Like, no. Yeah. No. But don't I be there for you? Let you be benched up and bring you here. Make sure you get everything taken care of. But I'm less demanding. <laughs> Hello. How you Hi. doing, doctor? Hi. I really wanted to take a look at the scalp and mm -hmm. under my boob area mm -hmm. um, today and, you know, kind of give me some feedback. And I also did want to get referred to a dermatologist. Yes, most definitely. <clears throat> like I said, for, for a while now, but. Mm -hmm. Oh, bless your heart. Okay. Yeah. Is it itchy? Um, yeah. It's painful. I yeah. Is it only on the base of your neck? No, or really it just kind of cuts? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it does come behind my ears, but it's literally like behind my ears and literally this. Your ear looks irritated right there. Yeah. So it's behind my ears, sometimes on the ear and just the hairline. Put it in there. Yeah. Then let's try some topicals and let me get you referred to a dermatologist, okay? Okay. All right, guys. So she's going to be sending me some topicals to um, use for my head. So I'm going to find it. That's going to be that. And, and she's going to be referring you to the dermatologist. Oh, yeah. And That's referring good. Me, yeah, referring me to the dermatologist. So I am so excited about that because I definitely need to go. Um, but like she was saying, you know, I wanted to go to the dermatologist a long time ago. But I was just so busy and stuff. But like she said, 
Do you have any autoimmune diseases in the family? You know, I don't think so, but I don't think so. What would that be considered? Like um, rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, um, psoriatic arthritis, that arthritis kind. Arthritis and lupus. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to draw a autoimmune lab for you today, too, okay. okay, because, you know, if we go somewhere, they're going to know that, too, and that's going to be um, a better way to treat you, okay? Okay. All right, y'all, Mahogany just left out. They're going to do some labs real quick um, on her. Um, the doctor came in, as you saw, we was having me a conversation um, about if, you know, she had any, basically, I guess, any uh, diseases or things in her family. Uh, she said lupus and arthritis, so the doctor's gonna go on and you know pull blood and all that stuff that way when they refer her to the dermatologist um, They'll know ahead of time, you know, if anything's related to that So uh, she'll be right back and uh, give us an update on that y'all uh, Me and Miles over here just chilling chilling up in here y'all chilling need a little snack need a little Need a little breakfast this morning a little hungry y'all. I'm trying to tell you I'm hungry. My stomach is hungry. Pray for me so I know you said you want to do the lab. So did you have like any concerns or something? Yeah, I'm or... checking for your autoimmune diseases. Okay. Yeah, Christy. Yeah. All righty, guys. So we just got back in the car. Uh, so you had went and got the labs, right? Yeah. That's what you did. So. Yeah, I went and got labs. So what they? Well, how was that? What would they do? Draw blood or something? Yeah. So they drew. Um, as I was saying, um, God, I was trying to get the best clips I could, but um, they end up doing a autoimmune test okay like blood count and then they did like a complete blood count okay. so they just wanted to um check for really like this whole auto immune system thing mm -hmm. so i'm hoping those come back negative um and it's just a what is it just a psoriasis issue gotcha. and not a autoimmune issue so i'm like i'm not really nervous i mean because you know Hey, whatever it is, we're just going to go from there. But if it is an autoimmune issue, then I'm going to have to go see, like, a blood doctor and, you know, it, all of that. Oh, so, process. I'm hoping it's just, like, a just a dermatologist situation and we just get the scalp treated. Mm -hmm. um, oh, did she say that she sent me some prescriptions? I don't see them. Oh, they're probably already at the, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, she did put send me some prescriptions just to put on there to kind of treat it starting off, but... Mm -hmm. Um, I'm just hoping it's a dermatology situation, but we'll keep you know yeah, you guys we'll updated keep, for sure. Definitely keep y'all updated. Make sure y'all out here, y'all you know life gets busy, but make sure y'all out here checking on your health. For real, uh, you got to check on your health. Um, so I'm glad that you, uh, Mahogany was able to schedule this appointment. Yeah, we'll definitely keep y'all on journey. I don't know if y'all remember the video when you I mean when you first I think when you first got the condition on your head yeah Cause it was even worse back then like now you've been maintaining it yeah uh, but um we'll but even then that's why it's so important for you to like check on your health because even then the doc i didn't do my research mm -hmm. and i just had went to the emergency room and they're like oh it's fungal and they treated me like it was a yeah, no fungal. that won't fungal baby and I so i see a lot of things that won't fungal so it was like i was treated for that but that didn't take it away because that wasn't yeah. what it was so that's why it's so important that you like do your own research got to be your own advocate mm -hmm. and then when you go to these doctors sometimes you might not know what it is but if yeah. you still can do your own research and get a ballpark that way you know yeah of course so uh like i say y'all do your research take care of your health out here in these streets for real. don't be just taking town off and ibuprofen and everything get your health nah, straight seriously. come on get your health straight uh, walk a little bit, eat better. I'm preaching to you and myself. <laughs> um, cause we got to do, we got to take care of our health because at the end of the day, we ain't got us. We ain't got nothing. I ain't got nothing. Listen, you can have a nice car, nice house, but if your health ain't together, uh, you want to be able to enjoy it. Y'all exactly. hear what I'm saying? So, That's but nice. anyway, guys, we was, uh, we glad we were able to think, uh, to, able to take you, uh, with us at my doctor's appointment. Uh, we get ready to get out of here. But listen, guys, make sure you drop, um, uh, and if you got any questions about, uh, the psoriasis or, um, if you got any, um, if you know of any information, drop it down in the comments, guys. We want to hear from you. Yeah. Yep. Also, if you like done something, experienced something like this, you know, let me know. I'm definitely interested in your feedback too. Like, mm -hmm. you know, um, because we, we, 
you know, it's so many people that watch our channel and like when I be putting when we be putting stuff out, like people be having the same issues or the same situations mm -hmm. and we can all help each other. I'm gonna take you on my journey and you can let me know how you've been on this journey before as well. So Yeah, yeah. So definitely guys. So thank you for rocking with us. We'll get ready to get out of here, guys. I'm your boy Justin. And I'm Hogan. Listen, do us a favor and guys remember to uh uh hit that uh, subscribe button. Turn on those post notifications when yeah. you do. Make sure you comment down uh, below. Today's shout out notification winners goes to boom, 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 boom. Thank you for being the true supporters that you are. But guys, remember if you keep it locked, we're going to show you how to keep your life lit. Listen, we out of here and we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Try to catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on. Bought a two-seater, yeah, we heading for the sun. Try to get my high, I ain't tripping for the fun.